I'm still the same, lost in a different world, so close but so far away. Maybe if I close my eyes, it will all disappear. No, still here, great big wall. Please somebody help, anybody help me. Every year, the United States government deports its own veterans. Many of them were brought to the United States as children and were lawful permanent residents. Like so many veterans, after serving in the military, they struggled to readjust to civilian life and committed offenses like drug possession. Although they served their time, they face an additional punishment and effectively a life sentence in deportation. Separated from their families and unable to access their VA benefits, thousands of veterans have weighed their chance to return home. Hector Barajas is one of these veterans. He served as a paratrooper in the United States Army. After being deported to Tijuana, he opened his home to provide shelter to others like him. When I was enlisting into the military, I remember my, my dad and my mom saying this, the military went out of their way to try to get me to join the military. And uh, when we needed help, nobody, nobody was there. Stand with our veterans. Leave no man behind. Take action to bring our troops home.